35 now, and the stage is buzzing. Hundreds of students will put their spelling smarts to the test during the 92nd annual Scripps National Spelling Bee. That includes one Kern County teen. And Mary Kate Podcat joins us this morning in the newsroom with a look at how the students got to the national stage. Good morning, Mary Kate. Good morning, Alex. That's right. 14 year old Gabriel Nobleza is one of the 565 spellers competing in the Bee this week. The eighth grader attends Pioneer School in Delano. He and his family came to the U.S. when he was just two years old. Gabriel and 11 million other students started their journeys to the B more than eight months ago, but only a few hundred made it to the stage in Maryland. The spellers represent schools nationwide, grades one through eight, with the youngest speller being just seven years old. B Week kicked off yesterday with a preliminary test. Today, students will take the stage with hundreds of other students for the first round of on-stage spelling. They're all vying for the title of the nation's top speller. A $50,000 cash prize, trophy, and bragging rights, rights come along with it. And we have a few fun facts about the B. As we mentioned, there are 565 spellers competing. 48 of them are from California. For some spellers, it's all in the family. Seven sets of siblings are competing together, including two sets of twins. B Week is nothing new for more than 160 spellers. They're returning for another go round. Two of those spellers are making, get this, their fifth appearance. The preliminary rounds are today and tomorrow. The finals are on Thursday, and we'll definitely be keeping an eye on Gabriel. Alex. All right, Mary Kay, I have to test you on your spelling skills oh, no. here. I just have one word for you, okay? And oh, no. Be, not on my TV, Alex. No, I will just tell you. I I'm getting embarrassed. You, hold on, hold on. I, 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 first off, here's, here's my disclaimer. I would never ever get this word right. I'm just curious what? to see how far you would go. Oh no. The, the winning word last year for the 2018 spelling okay. bee was koinonia. Huh? What does that mean? I don't even know I that okay. starts with Here's a the C, definition. a Q, a K. I can't okay. even tell the you. Word, I'm going to pretend like I'm saying it in, in a professional setting. The word is koinonia. Can you use it in a sentence? <laughs> I, I can't use it in a sentence because I don't, <laughs> I don't know. But the Fair, definition give me the is origin. Intimate spiritual communion and participative sharing in a common religious commitment and spiritual community. Yeah, you know, Alex, Koinonia. I'm a millennial and I definitely rely on spell check, so I'm going to send that back to you. Okay. You can't even, you can't even like, guess? <laughs> no, I can't even tell you. It starts it, a Q, a K, a C. I don't know. It's Okay, well, we will put this definition on our website or our social media pages, and I will give you a hint. It starts with a K. Okay, let's get to know, but <laughs> I'm going to send it back. Sorry to, to put you on well, the spot there. Mary Kate, you get to check, test him next time. Yeah. Okay, yeah, oh, yeah, I'm going to come back with, with a good word for you, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks, Mary Kate.